Our island is a little chunk of coral in the Solomon Archipelago. It is nameless, and the great war beyond its horizons ignores us. For we are the expendables of an amphibious landing left to guard a forgotten outpost of the Imperial Japanese Army. Months ago, our communicational equipment was destroyed by storm. We have no contact with our base. I, Lieutenant Kuroki, who is really two men, two enemies at war with each other, the soldier with the blood of ancient warriors in his veins, and the man of peace who admires men's works and not their destruction. As the commander of this platoon of castaways, I have ordered the construction of a boat, hoping to restore our supply line from Bougainville. It appears that we and our enemy are about even in men and weapons, and bad luck. They too are marooned with no means of communication. It was plain they couldn't radio their ship. To adjust to our Stone Age standard of living will not be easy for them. Evidently, they have no provider like my good, simple-minded Okuda. I've been waiting for you, Mac. You're sure a slowpoke. I want you to answer me a few questions, boy. First off, how many men you got scattered around this island? Come on, boy. You're being interrogated. Talk a little English. You listen to me. You're just giving me a dumb act. I'm going to ream your belly button. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shucks. Never could stick a guy when he was smiling at me. Fact is, where I come from, we don't shoot nobody who's got a knack for catfish or a sour mash. How you like them cigarettes, Tojo? Oh, son of a... Oh. Hot wampum from PX. Oh. See you again, boy, and we'll talk some more. What's on your dinner? Yeah, baby. How strange are these barbarians? Ferocious, yet capable of human reasoning. We don't shoot nobody who's got a knack for fish. So, this afternoon, I undertake an intelligence mission. Finally, I discover what I am really looking for. Their commander, my colleague in the game of death, Oh, yes, I know him at once by his lonely detachment from the others. Why are we trying to kill each other? Old tribal custom. Our fight is 
Just about that archaic. It's so right. I am no longer of any military value to Japan. Nor you to the United States. I'm marooned up to my ears in greenhorns. What happened to the seasoned veterans? Well, after seeing some of your boys, I figured I didn't need them. Look, you and I are professionals. We might just as well level with each other. Professional? Well, perhaps I am by heritage. So, uh, I think there's a next move, Captain, which we should consider with professional calm. A truce? Yes. With one reservation. If either of us again becomes part of the war potential of his country, we fight. Well, that goes without saying. Then, a truce it is, and all the water you can drink. Lieutenant Kroki? Yes. You can take us for whatever it's worth. Maybe that's not much. But you're a hell of a guy. Thanks. You sure undermined his character. The senses grow becalmed here. All except yours and mine. Make your point. I shall try to ferret out your radio. Be sure you don't mistake your target the next time. Well, wait a minute, then it was you, not the fisherman. Of course. But I find no dishonor in you. What you're doing for your men, I would do for mine. Well, believe it or not, I regret there's nothing I can do for you. Ah, uh, but there is. You can wish me luck. I wish you this much, that you find your way home to that house with a mountain. I hope you find a place as peaceful as that one. I could use it. Good luck, Hiroki. Good luck to me? I am convinced he means it. Good luck and good aim and the bullet to silence his anguish. I can read the truth in their faces, and it is no surprise to me. Against the inevitable, I have already distributed our last few rounds of ammunition. I have prepared for what I must now do. Lieutenant Kuroki. Our communications have been restored. One of our destroyers is on her way to remove us from this island. Captain Dennis has extended me permission to offer you terms. Surrender? Yes, you and your men receive good treatment. Prisoners of war. No, oh, thank you. As you can see, I am moving my camp. Yes, we looked for you there. That position was no longer defensible, since you know it so well. We wouldn't attack you, Lieutenant. I would. The truce is ended. I belong to the Japanese army. Until my country advises otherwise, I remain at war. Ah. 
I'm sure. You understand, Captain? I understand. Goodbye, my friend. He's had it. Looks like you won again, Danny boy. He told me to give you this. Written in Japanese. What do you make of it? A little like it, Savvy. It looks like an address. Ah, maybe one of these days I'll be flying a crate of greenhorns into Japan. I'll look into it. Captain, that flag's still up there. You want me to take it down? Sears Island. Yes, and my friend the captain can tell you that my good soldiers were always defended. For there is no death where the spirit lives. So do not grieve, my dear Keiko when he brings you my journal. This was only another day, and I say good night.